Hey Royal Caribbean Cruisers, visiting Perfect Day at Coco Key has changed over the last year and we're sharing some updated tips and tricks with you so you can save time and money and make the most of your day on the island. If you're new here, hi, I'm Sherry with CruiseTipsTV.com and we're so glad you're here. My family and I invite you to subscribe for the latest tips, tricks, and cruise packing advice. We've got some awesome subscriber tips at the end, so stay to the end to check those out too. All right, our number one tip is so important right now. Perfect day is busy, busy, busy. And often there are multiple ships there on the same day. So it's key to book your activities and experiences as soon as you book the cruise. Promise me, you'll do this. Pretty much everything can sell out early right now, you guys. Coco Beach Club, the zip line, up, up and away, Thrill Water Park, Book it all as early as you can in your cruise planner. You can always change your mind and cancel or rebook if the activity or excursion price goes down or if you change your mind. Speaking of Thrill Water Park, on peak days, it gets really crowded. We're talking lines down the tower crowded. For the best chance at minimal lines, get off the ship as early as possible in the morning or linger on the island until right before all aboard time. There's usually a lull at the very end of the day. So if you get a second wind, stick around and enjoy the water slides while everyone else is heading back to the ship for a shower and a nap. On perfect day, by the way, all of your excursions are paperless. Your sail and sign card is your excursion ticket. So no need to worry about paper tickets anymore. Okay, so you're packed up, you're ready to hit the island. You might wanna consider taking the tram around the island. You can walk, but in the heat, I recommend you save your energy. The tram greets you right when you get off the ship and it takes you everywhere from Thrill Water Park to basically every beach and attraction around the island. Now for our favorite thing about Perfect Day. Well, it's my favorite thing about Perfect Day. There are bars all over the island and your drink package works on perfect day. Not all cruise line private islands allow you to use your drink package at their private destination. So get the most out of this. There's a floating bar, a swim up bar, beach bars, bars inside the water park. Like I said, there's bars everywhere. <laughs> Just have fun. Be sure to stay super hydrated. Get a bottle of water every time you get a drink. All right, let's back up and talk about what to take with you when you get off the ship. Towels are actually available on the island now. You can certainly pack them with you and sometimes I do it anyway, but if you wanna save a little room in your day bag, grab them on the island. Speaking of day bags, we have a perfect shore day bag list on our website and we'll link to it in the description of this video. You can even watch it in video format if you like. We'll put both of them in the description for you. All right, now sunscreen. Let's talk about sunscreen. It is so essential, especially if you're spending a lot of time at the wave pool. Be sure to reapply. Throw a water park, same rule applies. We also recommend packing a rash guard for sun protection and a hat like this one and some sunglasses. The sun is really bright out there and you just don't wanna get burned. Oh, and there's some great shopping at Perfect Day at Coco Key, so if you forget something, you'll be okay. There's Royal Caribbean and Perfect Day branded stuff, but you'll also find little shopping kiosks with hats, again, like this one, swim cover-ups, t-shirts, and pretty much everything you'd find at like a straw market. The best part is you can pay with your sale and sign card, so you can leave your cash on the ship. We do, however, recommend packing some small bills to tip bartenders on the island or maybe your attendant if you booked a cabana or a beach bed. Lastly, life jackets are available once you get onto the island, so definitely don't pack those from home. All right, are you looking for a party vibe? Uh, we know where to send you. Oasis Lagoon is where you are going to find the party. With a swim up bar and spring break type atmosphere, head here if you want sun, drinks, and DJ slash spring break vibes. That's where the party's at. All right, you getting hungry yet? Well, there's loads of food options around the island, but don't walk away from your food or the seagulls will converge. Seriously, it's a problem, folks. But the food is really delicious and you will not go hungry at perfect day. 
For some ideas of things to order, try the chicken sandwiches at the snack shack or a refreshing salad. The salads are actually delicious and a lot of people don't even know that you can get them. Also, cookies and brownies get rave reviews as well. And that's probably because they're good, but also because everything just tastes better at the beach, right? That's what I'm thinking. All right, you guys, have you seen the prices for cabanas these days at Perfect Day? Yikes, they are so high right now. In our opinion, you don't need a cabana. There's ample complimentary seating all around. But here's a tip from subscriber Brenda if you're looking for an in-between option. She says, while you don't have to spend a penny to have a great time, the beach beds are an excellent lower cost option for a family. Beach beds, not cabanas. They offer shade, a comfy place to lounge, and a cooler full of cold bottled water and two pool floats. They're closer to about $200 and Brenda said they're totally worth every penny. While she would love to splurge for an overwater cabana, the prices are just totally outrageous. All right, how about Coco Beach Club? Eric says book early and get to uh, the Coco Beach Club really early because you can get a um, like a day bed. They're like these sort of loungers that are in the water, but they go really fast. So not only do you want to book it early, but get over to the Coco Beach Club early. Lastly, friends, there's so much free stuff to do at Perfect Day. You don't have to spend money to have a blast on the island. In fact, subscriber Melissa lays it out for us. She said, my daughter has a blast with the splash pads, playing in the sand, and swimming in the pools and ocean. She loves to swim in the pools and ocean, but mostly just watch her kid have the time of her life while sipping a Coco Loco, which is included in the drink package. All right, friends, you are ready to hit perfect day at Coco Key. We hope you have an amazing time. If you made it to the end of this video, I see you. I know you made it. Thank you for doing that, by the way. Be sure to subscribe and drop us a red or yellow heart in the comments. And until next time, we'll see you on the high seas. Bye-bye. Thank you.